Let's go to Katie Goss. Well, Sergey, we honored you before the game for your 500 games, and you get one of the biggest wins for yourself this season, 44 saves. Just what can you say about the performance tonight of the team? Yeah, it was, uh, it was definitely great. Uh, the, the whole, the organization, the team, the club made that night special for me. So I really appreciate for the, uh, everything they have done. It was definitely special and memorable. And so it was fun. It was fun. I thought, I thought guys did a great job, uh, scored good goals, you know, defensively. Uh, we were tied, and uh, it's a big win for us, and it's a special night for me, definitely. And a special night for Alexander Wemberg. He gets his first career hat trick. Just have to be so happy to see him really stepping up and embracing this new opportunity with Florida. Yeah, definitely. He's a, he's a great guy. He's a great guy in the locker room. You know, he's so, so skilled. And it's, uh, it's, it's great to see him score some goals and, uh, and make some plays. So he's a, he's a great player, and uh, we're all uh, happy for him. Well, this team got some key players back tonight. You were able to get wins when they weren't in the lineup. How good are you guys feeling now having them all back and being able to get just a cohesive victory? Yeah, definitely those guys are big pieces of our team and we were uh, so excited to have them back and I think they were, they stepped up and uh, they play right away, really good heavy team, how they, how they usually play, you know, it seems like they ne never miss the game. So it's a great professional guys and uh, we're, we're happy that they're back healthy and uh, so we move on. Well, congrats on the win, Bob, and we're looking forward to hearing all about your safari that you'll be going on soon. Yeah. Thank you very much, yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Congrats, obviously, on your debut. Kind of take us through today. When did you find out you'd be playing, and kind of what was this process like getting ready and then finally actually getting out there? Um, thank you. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I came to the rink this morning, and, you know, they told me to prepare as if I was going to play on uh, Friday. So I was trying to do that, but I really didn't think I was going to be in tonight. And, um, you know, I came in to do the testing and the rest of my physical stuff, and they told me before morning skate. And... You know, I immediately like, got the jitters right away and, you know, I called my parents when I left. Everyone was excited. So um, it's been a pretty crazy day, but an exciting day. And you were playing at North Dakota less than a week ago. How, you talked about being ready for the jump, but how different was the jump once you got actually out there? Um, yeah, well, it's, I mean, it's the National Hockey League. It's obviously a jump from college, but, um, you know, just, just the faster play, I think, is, you know, kind of what stood out to me. Uh, things happen quicker. Uh, you know, guys are uh, better at making plays, and you know it's a little tougher to defend. So I think that's uh, the main thing that kind of stuck out for me. We'll go to George Richards, Florida Hockey Now. Hey, thanks. Um, were you able to get family and anybody here to, to be at the game? Yeah, they uh, they came down yesterday, so okay. I had a, a big group. I was fortunate to have a lot of people come down. They give you a uh, they give you a sweet or something, or how that work? Um, yeah, I believe they. Yeah, I believe they are up in a suite tonight, so you know they're loving that for sure. And are they gonna let you keep that warm-up jersey uh, with, with the, uh, the Russian last name on the back? Pretty nice movie right there. Yeah, no, I don't think so. But that was a cool jersey. Never seen my name in Russian before. It's a little different. <laughs> Congrats. Thank we'll you. We'll go to Katie Gaz, Bali Sports, Florida. Yeah, no, that means everything for me. You know, it's one thing if they, they're going to be watching either way, but it's different if they were here or at home on TV. And, you know, to have everyone down here, um, you know, just the phone calls I've gotten from all of them the past couple of days is, it's uh, pretty special. You know, I think, I think uh, my parents might have been more excited than I was, but, you know, they're, they're fired up and, you know, we're all happy. We're all happy we're here. It's a, uh, it's a great fit and we all love it here. Kenny, first off, congratulations on the hat trick. Uh, just, you're uh, you look at, you know, possessed out there in the second period. Yeah, I mean, it was, uh, I think we played a really good game. And, uh, I mean, our line getting on cornerback as well, it just, I feel like we created some really good chances. And uh, for me to put the back, uh, put the puck back on the net is a really good thing as well. Just, just the whole game was great. And uh, celebrating Bob for his 500 games. So uh, it's just a great way to uh, play a game for sure.
Is it any more special to do it against your former teammates, or you've played them so many times now, it doesn't matter anymore? I mean, it's always a little bit special to play against them. Uh, I mean, obviously, it's uh, like you said, we played on a bunch in the past, but uh, it's one of those games right now, you're excited for this game, and uh, I mean, just the way it played, it felt like we had a good one as well, so it's just a lot of fun out there. We'll go to David DeWork, Local 10. Hey, Alex. So, last game, you got your first overtime goal in almost four years, and now you get your first hat trick. Uh, it's just a pretty big week for you, huh? Yeah, it's a, it's a great week. Uh, I mean, right now it's uh, kind of working my way a little bit. So I'm just trying to ride the wave a little bit and just keep doing the same thing. And hopefully I can get uh, some more next game as well. Jameson Olive, FloridaPanthers.com. Hey, talked about getting uh, Barkey and uh, Horny back in there. Obviously, we know who they are. But did it just feel different having them back in the lineup? Did you feel that boost? I mean, they're such a good player, so to get them back in the lineup, for sure, it's uh, it's really good for us to have it. And just for them coming back, I feel like they played really good games. Like I said, they've been away from a little bit, but you stepped right in and made made a difference. So obviously, it's a boost for the team, and uh, I feel like we took advantage of it as well. Thanks, Wayne. Thanks. Hey, Sergey. It looked like it was a special night for you uh, before and during and after the game. Uh, Look like a, a, a fun night for you. Yeah, it, it definitely was. So I was. It was a special night since I stepped in into the locker room before you know before the game to see the all the jerseys, last names on Russian, and how the boys are talking about try to figure it out that quest what's going on with their last name. So and all the way through, you know, like as as you said, I I was uh, trying to take the every every moment you know and uh, enjoy the and sour the every moment of this special night and the guys did a great job so i really appreciate the whole organization the my teammates and everybody it's uh it was it was definitely special and memorable night for me so thank you so much and on the ice you had a lot of work right i mean 44 saves uh you were uh, throwing them back tonight yeah, it's uh, it's again, you know, it's 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 great to be in action, and uh, so it's it's as as the season goes on, there is sometimes 20 shots, sometimes it's 40 shots. So you just there for your teammates and uh, trying to step up and uh, do your best when they need you, you know. And I'm always happy to help, and uh, it was it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure to play, and uh, again, the guys did a great job offensively, scored three big goals. And in the, in the second period, so and then they just uh, shut down in the third period. So it was was a great game all over. We'll go to David DeWork, local ten. Hey Sergey, um, just in terms of uh, from from the goalie's perspective, it's not always so easy to to have that kind of a ceremony before the game and the distractions and the delay, and then to go out and be so focused and able to play like that. How are you able to kind of stay in your zone with so much going on before the game? Yeah, it's uh, it's 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 maybe a little bit challenging, yes. But on the other hand, you know, it's 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 kind of my my night, and uh, it was a special night for me. And uh, I try to enjoy the every moment, every every second of this, you know. And I didn't think about the pressure or whatever, like distractions or whatever. So I just tried to have uh, go out there, have fun, and enjoy the win after with my teammates. Jameson Olive, FloridaPanthers.com. Uh, a very unique gift for you tonight, a safari in Tanzania. Uh, did you think that was coming, and how much are you looking forward to that? No, I didn't expect that, definitely. But that's uh, it's something that I planned for in course of my life, you know, to go to visit there and see the animals and life. So it was kind of like uh, I was surprised, and it was right hit in the bullseye. So it was was perfect, and I'm really excited. And uh, just I have to plan it perfectly. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's 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 again. I, I really appreciate for the gift. It's 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 special and it's awesome. Hey, coach. Well, obviously, uh, you know, a lot to go around in terms of uh, success tonight. But you know, Alexander Wenberg, first career hat trick, just looked like a man on a mission every time he shot the puck. Just you know, what can you say about his effort tonight? Yeah, he had a heck of a game. Uh, did a lot of good things uh, besides scoring three. Um, you know, scoring the overtime game the other night, uh, you know, I certainly uh, gave him a little excitement as well. So it's a, uh, so we'll, uh, you know, we're happy with his game. Um, he's, he's, he, he's adding some speed to his game as well. Um, puck was following him around a little bit, but a couple of great shots. 
We'll go to Jameson Olive, FloridaPanthers.com. Kirsten uh, skated about 12 minutes, had a couple blocks out there. Just from a guy that was playing college less than a week ago, what did you think of the game tonight? I thought he looked really comfortable, looked poised, uh, did a lot of good things. Um, I like the way he sees and processes the game, uh, positionally aware, um, had a good stick. Um, you know, so I think that uh, it was a, I think it was a really good game for him to start. David Dwork, Local 10. Hey, Joel, uh, your top defensive pairing, new top defensive pairing of uh, Weir and Forsling, uh, they had a ridiculous night, but I think they combined for like four points, a plus seven. Uh, what, what are your thoughts on them as they're kind of getting acclimated to one another? Uh, I thought they're really good. I thought uh, I thought their positioning, uh, their contesting of the pucks uh, through the middle of the ice. Uh, don't even give them the red line or don't give them the blue line. Uh, tremendous gap, and from there, uh, turning pucks up ice, and whether they're skating it up, moving the puck up ice, and uh, and being a part of the attack. Uh, you know, they were very involved. Uh, you know, Weeks had a special shot tonight. Uh, you know, I think Forrest is uh, you know just adding something every game. Uh, but they were real strong collectively as well. Take our last questions from George Richards, Florida Hockey Now. Joel, you guys have won five in a row now. Uh, we talked so much about your, your hot start, but how, how pleased are you that you guys have been able to continue this well into the second half of the season? Well, we had a little hiccup there. You lose uh, three out of four. Three, you know, use uh, three in a row, four to five. Uh, you think that okay? How we, you know, and we're missing key guys. So that was a good test, and how we responded there was a uh, excellent answer to what we're looking for. And I think that, uh, you know, I think that's progress. Knowing that uh, we did face a little adversity, even though I still didn't mind how we were playing in those games. Um, and we're competing in those games, so we haven't uh, dropped off the. Uh, Every single game, finding a way to be competitive and getting points is part of it. And um, playing the score, the last couple of games, we've had some, uh, two of the last three, we've had some decent leads for parts of the game and uh, still doing some decent things uh, for the most part, uh, playing with a lead as well. Thanks. Thank you, Coach.